Welcome back as Mortal Kombat 1 is free to play this weekend on Steam Store. The free trial includes first two chapters of the game's story mode. We can also fight against other players online. Tutorial of Invasion mode is also playable. Now in this video I'll be testing the game on my Steam Deck with SteamOS and ROG Ally with Windows 11. I'll kick things off with the former using Proton version 8.0-5 as the compatible delay. This game is marked as Steam Deck verified. Shaders are getting compiled. Mortal Kombat 1 is a sequel to 2019's Mortal Kombat 11 taking place in a new timeline created by Liu Kang in his ending of 11's Aftermath expansion. In this new timeline, Liu Kang assembles fighters to participate in the latest Mortal Kombat tournament in Outworld while contending with an alliance found by Titan Shang Tsung. If we purchase the game, our progress from the free trial will be carried over to it. Performance tab, overlay level set to 3. Frame limit set to 60, that's it. In game settings. Using the low graphics preset, 800p resolution, FSR to enable, performance preset, upscaling sharpness level set to 40. In game basing disabled. Start the game. First, I'll play through the story mode. We have access to the first two chapters. I'll start a fight from the first chapter, Snowden. Sixty FPS during the cutscene. Scorpion of Sub Zero have attacked us. Chill dude, does not care about the fighting going on. Oh my god. I didn't do anything. Incompetent. Sliced in. Oh, that works. I have had enough of you. No, he's angry. Then go before I put you down like the rest of your Lin Kuei. You haven't a prayer against the Lin Kuei's Real time gameplay. Fight. Alright, fight has had it. FPS is around 45 to 50. Almost hitting the GP bottom end. Audio is not stuttering. You can definitely play the game on Steam Deck. Image quality is looking decent. Okay, I'm taking a lot of damage. <laughs> Got frozen there. Need to create some space. It's going to be very close. <laughs> Both have low HP. Oh no, he used the fatality blow. This sequence runs at 30 FPS. You which is here. Oh my god. The spike pierced through my skull. I lost the battle. I'll load another sequence now. Next we have the invasions mode. Only its tutorial section is available. During the invasion mode FPS is capped at 30 as you can see. I'll start a fight. Playing as Sub Zero. Fight started. Even here we are getting around forty five FPS. This is Johnny K's mansion, the arena. Ah, oh, KO. I only know the most set of sub zero in this game. Yeah, I'm on the fight. I 
Okay, so now I'll be fighting against another player online. Multiplayer mode works even on Steam OS out of the box. Versus mode, you can fight against a CPU opponent or another player online. Start a casual match. Found a player. I am from India. You can see the ping value here 250 milliseconds. There will be a few hiccups during the match. My Steam Deck is connected to a 5 GHz band Wi Fi channel. For a more stable experience, you can uh, use the Ethernet wired connection. Peacemaker, John Cena. They are selecting the arena. I will let them do that. Okay, he's low on HP. He can win this fight. Or give to John Cena. Poetic justice. Final round. No, I'm not going to win low on HP. <laughs> he played it safe. <laughs> that game over for me now. 48 to 53 right, FPS. I will be testing the game on my ROG ally. My ally is running on BIOS version 337. I have installed the latest stable GPU drive from AMD. Current version of Adrenaline 24.2.1. For this game, I have set the UMA buffer size to 6 GB. Command center setting. First, I will run the game using a 25 watts manual profile. All three power values set at 25 watts. RSR disabled, CPU boost disabled, 900p resolution. Using a custom afterburner overlay to show you the performance metrics. It's a shame that in order to play the free trial, we need to download the entire game that weighs around 123 GB. Adrenaline settings. VSync enable, FreeSync enable. ADN anti lag setting enable. Not using AFML. RSR disabled. In game settings. 900p resolution FSR2 enable using its balance preset upscaling sharpness level set to 30 FPS limit set to 60 this game's FPS is capped at 60 in game leasing disabled ok so I'll just load the story mode first same fight Snowden Cutscene runs very nicely, I'll just skip it. Fight started. Yeah, our game is running very smoothly. 57 to 60 FPS. Rog LS display supports VRR. Its VRR range is from 48 to 120. Animation looks very smooth and the FPS is within the VRR range. No screen tearing. And there you go. I load the invasion mode. Before doing that, let me just use the 15 watts profile now. Hell 
help in conserving the battery total power draw will drop now yeah APU is drawing around 14 watts of power I <laughs> got frozen there we are still getting around 45 to 47 FPS I'll be honest guys on Ally game seems to be running smoother compared to Steam Deck I think it's due to the VRR Steam Deck display does not support it You can play the game with the 15 watts profile as well. This is very impressive. It's not expecting this total power draw 25 watts. You'll be getting a playtime of around 1 or 50 minutes on a full battery. Are you sure you're a grandmaster? Invasion mode. Here we're getting around 30 FPS. I'm still using the 15 watts profile. Start a fight. Busted by nuts. I put Ozim. Forty-five to fifty FPS. In terms of raw performance, both Ally and uh, Steam Deck perform similarly. But animation feels smoother on raw Ally. The rest, it's up to you. Personally, I would recommend playing the game using the 25 watts profile. FPS will be within a range of 57 to 60 for the most part. You'll be getting a buttery smooth experience. Okay, now I'll fight against another player online. RK Odin. For the online mode, I'll be using the 30 watts manual profile. We want the FPS to be as high as possible connecting the charger. Found a player, both of us are new players, being 180 milliseconds. I'll play as sub zero. I'm on the right side. Waiting for the other player to select their character. And they are doing it now. Reptile. Cam your partner. Other player selecting the arena. Yeah, a few hiccups at the start. Not something to be proud of, Sub Zero. Fight started. Close them. FPS is close to 60, that's really good to see. Block my death. Landed it again. I love the RQ. Oh my god. What the hell was that? Acid spit. I can do this. Oh nice dodge. Almost. Yeah. FPS mostly stayed around 60. It's a very smooth experience on Rob LA. Playing against other players online. Couldn't land a blow. So bad at this. Close them again. This time my round kick landed. Yeah, I need to block these attacks. Very annoying.
fatal blow. It landed. Should do a lot of damage. <laughs> there goes the race. 25 to 30 FPS. Smash them. I'm low on HP, need to be careful. There, fatal blow. It landed as well. I'm done. You have tiny angry. Final round. Beside her. Keeping my distance. Did a lot of damage there. Should be able to win this round. There you go. I did it. Excellent experience on Rog Alley. That's it for the video guys, I hope you find it useful, thanks for watching and have a nice day.